Hey everyone, Decav13 here, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Metaphor Refantasio. Alright, let's head back what into the dungeon now. Then... So let's Where's go you? straight to where we were before at the old reservoir. Wow, we really haven't made it that... Um, okay. I really do wonder how deep in we are. Want to rest a bit? Oh, there's a few melancholia crystals in here. What the fuck? Oh, no. Is this a dead end? That's impossible. No. Morris had to have escaped through here. Let us search the area. Hey. Right there. I did a little bit of shopping and I got some new, uh, I got a, a, bit, a couple more medicines. Did right right there. Right here. Got a couple more medicines and a new weapon for Heisme, too. So this attack should do, yeah, a little bit more damage now. Oh, you resist Glenn. No ice. And resist light too. Wow, my attacks are Hold fucking on. useless here. You're here. Oh, You're damn it. Me. Me. At least the other one's still stuck. Observe the enemy. Oh, no, you're not. Uh oh. Oh, wait, hold on. I have. There we go. Was worried for a second there. <laughs> Not bad. Is that the end, then? Ah, we cleared the way. <laughs> oh, we're gonna have to run, aren't we? Yep. I'm sensing it. I've got a bad feeling about this. Well, it seems that bad feeling of yours was spot on. Really? Don't tell me. Uh, we are easy prey here. Run before we are eaten. Run over here. <laughs> really? Oh boy. It's a lift. Let's use it to escape. Oh, did we get away? <sighs> I thought we were goners. Heading up is the way to safety, right? A hairline escape indeed. We are fortunate there was a lift. We should be making our way into the castle proper now. Uh... Morris has to be somewhere ahead. He's gonna pay for making us go through that. Hey. We've come quite a ways up. Think we're inside the castle yet? No. It feels different than the part of the castle Barden took us to. More like a secret underground passage. It likely is. It makes sense that Morris would run this way. Let's do it. Morris can't have gotten far. Let's look for him. However. What now? Alright, so. Ah. Let's go save. I imagine right. we're coming upon a boss soon. No, let's uh, stick it over here. Let's go. Time for sure. Yeah, what a surprise. Yeah, Joanna's behind this. 
waits. So you were with her all along, were you? Planning to take her hostage, you cur? You would death threaten your liege lady? I don't think that's what's going on here, Hulkenberg. Wow. <laughs> For people who've made it this far, you really, you're really rather dull. Hopeless. Enough. What are you scheming, you knave? Don't tell me. Hey, was that the monster? You're long past due for being eaten. I delore you here to see it done. <laughs> and on that note, dinner is nearly served. Uh. What? Huh? Uh. What the? Why am I falling too? Oh, come on! Hey. Uh, hey. I said wake up! Think we'll make it? Finally. You okay? We got thrown into the cells while we were out. I managed to stay hidden inside your bag. You bastard! What the hell? Do you know who I am? I'm a bloody captain of the state of Grand Trad's bloody army! And this tawdy guard corps locks me up like I'm some criminal! I have never been so mistreated! Was that... that voice! Isn't that Captain Klinger, the one that fled from the mines? Why would he be here? Wow. If you're so important to the Royal Army, would you really be here alone? Not that it matters. It's nearly supper time. <laughs> no, please. I wouldn't even taste good. No. No. I don't want to believe it. That had to have been Captain Klinger's voice. They used him to feed the monster. So instead of returning the Grand Trad, he came to Martira, only to get caught by Morris. How terrible. Oh. Finally awake, eh? Got your friends in cages as well. Almost feeding time for the beasts. And you, my friends, are the next course. <laughs> this is what happens when you stick your noses where they didn't belong. But unfortunately, the time has come. There's a limit to how much bait we can procure. By the time the Guard Corps comes around, I'll be long gone from this backwater hovel. You lot stay healthy now, you hear? <laughs> Don't let them get away. Morris must think he can get out of the city. We gotta find him before he does. We don't have time to be stuck in a cell, that's for sure. Look. Oh, there's a contraption here that probably opens the cell. Sit tight, Galica to the rescue. Thank you, Galica. Really? What? Why do you open both cells? Watch out. Careful, we've got incoming. Let's do it. <laughs> right there. Okay, at least they're weak. Alright. <sighs> I think we managed to fend them off for the time being. What's everyone else doing? Perhaps. That voice. Is that you, Galica? Are you nearby? Was that? Hi, May? His voice is coming from past this gate. Hold on a second. Ah, oh, you two are all right. Well... Successful jailbreak, I see. We avoid being eaten yet again. Looks like everyone was locked in different cells. We've got to get them out quick. Hold on. Hold on a moment. That contraption seems to open the next cell as well. Right, but there's no other way around it. It seems each cell contains a different variety of monster. You should consider the order uh, you open the cells in. Please. Best to check in with the others as well. We leave our escape in your capable hands. Oh wait. Oh, I, I can't the check them. We could move something if we tried. <laughs> you found something. Maglapel. Okay, oh, don't want to open this one yet. <laughs> that should come in handy. Pocket it. That's the last <laughs> one we open. Okay. What do you think? Got it. Get ready. Fear not. I see the end. Time for some close. That was well done. Okay. Now we open Hulkenberg's. <sighs> it's over. Thank you for getting me out of there. I owe you. <laughs> What are you talking about? We're allies. Of course we'd help you. 
My thanks. I see. You have my thanks. Yeah! <sighs> what do you think? Got it. Okay? Stay on guard! There they are. Let's give them a fight. Expect no quarter. Right. Some darker arts. You put their weakness. I throw all our things. Move, Tyson. I'll destroy you. Still standing, I think. The freedom of a wanderer. Come forth, royal soul. There's one left for the captain. You now oh, accept your fate. Last is going to be Stroll. I'm in your debt again. Apologies for putting you through the trouble. No problem. Right back at you. Most important thing is that you're okay. <laughs> you are ever reliable. Yeah. Okay, there were chests in these. Whoa, that's lovely. Ooh, Antumbra igniter. Yeah, that seems pretty useful. Why not? Is Hulkenberg's agility plus three? You know what? I'm going to give her that. <sighs> there was another one over here. Whoa, that's lovely. Sapper pendant, prevent burn. Hmm, okay. <laughs> What now? Oh, let me just heal up Hulkenberg. Ah. And let's open what Stroll Cell. Got it. Watch out! Incoming! I see the enemy. <laughs> oh, debatable. We'll hold our ground. Fighting his anxiety and they're targeting him! <laughs> Oh, this is gonna. S oh, we're dead. Still fight. We're 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 just dead. That was like the worst situation we could have been in. With healing power. Thank you. I owe you. And it sucks that it doesn't get much better because we have a bunch of weaknesses. No, sword master. Yeah, you're just gonna keep doing that. So you're strong. Jesus fucking Christ! Like, can I get a second to fucking breathe here? What the fuck? I shall fight as the noble I am. This calls for one of these. Nope. Let's go. I'm gonna leave Heismate down for a little bit. Trust me. I owe you. Hulkenberg is justice She gets hit. She's in big trouble. I shall vanquish evil. Okay, good. Four hits. Uh, of course. Oh, and I'm burned now, too. Beautiful. Thank you. My thanks. Captain, you can brave in half. Take more damage this way, so be careful. No, no holding back. Oh, please. Of course, of course. Okay, me and Hulkenberg are dead. What the? F like, what the fuck is this shit? Are you fucking kidding me? You know what? Fuck it. Just 
just fucking kill me. Just fucking kill me at this point. There's no restarting that shit. Like, are you fucking kidding me? Will your tale end here? Okay, at least it takes me, like, right over here. Nice. Okay, let's not be a fucking idiot now. What do you think? Got it. I see the enemy. Time for some food. There we go. Oh, that that's a great help. Oh god damn it recovered from stun already. This won't do. Let justice prevail. I'll stay my blade. No. Sword master. All power of kings. Wait, using electricity to help me the cyclo. Yes. Jesus Christ. Great work, everyone. To ever greater heights. Looks like we're safe for now. You're a lifesaver. We made it. Sorry about all that. Thanks for the help. Okay? You're welcome. I'm glad you're safe. <sighs> Being eaten alive is not high on my own list of ways to go, so I do appreciate it. Got it. All presents and accounted for? Looks like it. Let's hurry after Morris then. He's probably trying to skip town as we speak. What? Impudent bastard. He has another thing coming. Hurry. Let's find a way back up. Morris will not wait long. <clears throat> Let me get that chest. This is amazing. Incredible. Ooh. Sleepy eyed katana. Oh come on, I just bought a new katana for him. Are you Why telling not? me he gets one here? That's way better. Alright, fine. Nice. I bet we'll find a use for that. The hell? This is This trail of blood is still fresh. This was the cell that Klinger was locked up in. I see. Klinger. I didn't think it was possible, but I guess it really was his voice I heard. Morris ended up using him as bait. That means the monster was here and <clears throat> No, oh, yeah, okay, that's where the monster is. Let's hurry. We found some incredible. Said that fifty percent HP to all allies. So I think very safe to say, uh Johannes, this is probably all Johannes' fault. A hole of money? Let me go save real quick. I don't know what's going to be waiting for us up ahead, and I want to save. <laughs> For a child. I thought Joanna was childless. At least right now. 
Didn't Barden say something about that? Is this where they kept the kids? And then let the monster in here fucking slaughter them? A strange thing to find locked away, isn't it? This portrait, tis most odd as well. Tis common for the noblesse to have a portrait painted in celebration of their child's birth. Yeah, that's weird. What the hell? This one neither her husband nor child. You know, you're right. I haven't really seen many portraits of a pregnant wife alone. Hey, look! A diary. Looks like it belonged to the nurse who raised Joanna's son. I see. Apparently, Joanna was unmarried. Never formally bound in marriage to the father of her child. So, hmm. twas a love child? An illicit affair? Apparently so. At least, here in Martira. The father was a foreigner of another tribe. Their marriage would never have been accepted. The traditionalists always say mixed blood children are abominations. Terrible omens. And superstitions like that tend to carry a lot more weight in the countryside. Joanna brushed it off. Said it was ridiculous and irrational. She was about to announce the child's birth. And then tragedy struck. The old woman. The nanny they'd hired. Oh. She killed the boy in his crib. What? Seems like this was around the time the human sightings were becoming more widespread. It would be easy to ascribe the birth as the ill-fated omen. But to justify murdering a child? Joanna's family was overjoyed. The deed kept the abomination out of the public eye. They never even investigated her crime. And Joanna's love, the father, was banished from the city. The nurse's diary concludes, Oh God, please forgive me for my sin most wicked. Oh, let's move on. This is looking worse by the minute. It really is. It's a diary. It seems about be about raising a child. D53. The child is growing up healthy. He's eaten a lot of food today, too. What a big eater, finishing his food in one bite. Ah, oh, my darling's the most precious baby in the world. Or so it says. Hey. I wonder if she's talking about Let's stash the that somewhere human. Safe. This is... My child has returned. God has answered my prayers. It says the child must surely be a gift from God himself. I will no longer be alone. She's talking about the human. Hmm. Something heavy placed inside? Look! This brick looks a bit unnatural, don't you think? Like something other than a baby was put in here. Sorry condition. An expectant mother should be hot a heartwarming sight, and yet it can't be. Hmm. Oh. It's definitely something I heard. I don't like this. I can sense that monster up ahead. Are you ready? Yes. Let's end this here. Time for a close to this case. What? Here already? <laughs> Is that a baby? <laughs> nope, not a baby. <laughs> Are you hungry? Oh, so fussy today. <laughs> Good God. This monster. Is it a human? <laughs> this is the child you hold so dear? So, all the victims you kidnapped. Oh, my darling has a hearty appetite. I had Morris deliver us food. Were you able to secure a meal? Well, um. Oh, useless. You have failed to eliminate the bounty hunters, and now you've led Paisme himself here. But no matter. You look tender enough for my darling's liking. Oh, bye, Morris. 
What? This is your child. It just devoured a man. All I see is a mindless monster. <sighs> and a monster is what I see. When I look upon the world, people are beasts of fear and superstition, murderers without remorse. I have done nothing they've not done to me. Abominations. They are the unnatural. They deserve to die. They should all be so glad to nourish my child. My dear, sweet child. A mother's love should nurture, but this is beyond the pale. And you, do you not condemn her? She kidnapped children, murdered them in cold blood, and would see you blamed for it. In truth, I know this woman's pain all too well. Huh? In the name of her child, she was willing to turn against the entire world. Behind her atrocities, I see the devotion of a bereaved parent. You found yourself unjustly in a terrible darkness, and I struggle to blame you. Burying your own child is unbearable. Grief and madness fill the gaps where love had been. But my eyes were opened. These people helped me see. The only way to beat the darkness is to confront it. Step by meager step. You must walk back to our reality. Look upon that and see true that it is not the child you once loved. Be silent. You know nothing of it. <laughs> Your sermons better suit a preacher, but that is not your place here. You are here to be eaten! Good. Show me your hate. Pour out your darkness. We'll fight, but not in justice's name. Grief is its own death, so we will show you life! Darling, are you still hungry? Mother wants you to play with your food! <laughs> Okay. Come, my darling. It's time for supper. Eat up. All the people had disappeared. This must have been the last thing they ever saw. We break this tragic curse here and now. It's the only way we might mourn them. Let us finish this, Captain. We'll put an end to this horror, whatever the cost. If we can figure out what it really is. This is so fucked win. up. Let's get after it. God damn. Like it sucks what Joanna went through, but Ugh, doesn't excuse this. Well, let's start with some attacks. Just gauge what we're dealing with here. Uh, I'm gonna move back row. I only have horse-drawn carriage. Okay. Um maybe there's a better choice. By this power. I'm gonna Tarakaja myself. And then I'll have these two use Battle Cry. It's I shall vanquish evil. Stare. Huh? Oh. I'm glad I took back row for that. Okay, I'd rather her not miss. So let's Allow cure that daze. I'm gonna try Cyclo. Okay, wind does some good damage. Let's go. Perfect punch. In that sword master. Slicer. Okay, four hits, nice. 
You know, I'm dazed. Okay, I'd really rather you not do that. I was saving this. He's gonna have a hard time I'd rather not have to waste two of my turns. Oh, fantastic, and then we miss. Focused aim. Gathering power. Okay, so we should probably guard on this. Staying on the defensive. I will survive. Ready for impact. They'll not break my defenses. Jumping playtime. Yep. Okay, good call on my part. And we're protected from ailments because we guarded. Nice. Is everyone okay? That thing's been staring at us for a while now. It's so creepy. Think we could take out the eyes? Wait. Yes. Okay, good. That's it. The eyes. Then it shouldn't be able to daze us anymore. I bet if you go for those huge eyes, they'll have a hard time hitting us. We can't afford to feel sorry for it right now. Wait for an opening and try blinding it. If we hit its eyes, sword it around so much. Oh, resist, eh? Some darker arts. Okay, Let's magic seems to magic work on the eyes. I'm gonna heal. Quite a boon. I'm I imagine Who's Pierce up? would probably be effective against the eyes. Shut up. What a strike. Okay, strike works on the eyes, just not slash. Oh, and everyone's defense fell. I think that might have been almighty damage. Okay, uh, stroll. I'm gonna have you. Oh, we don't have all that. Oh, actually, yeah, let's do that. Spirit dust. I knew you'd help. My friends. Thank you. Everyone else focus on hitting the eyes. Rancor. Captain, magic seeker. Cyclo on the left eye. Still here? Nice. Okay, Hulkenberg takes out the eye. There we go. He missed stroll. That's good. Oh, the eyes have different resistances. I guess they do. Oh no, never mind. It's the same resistances. Oh, power of kings. Some darker arts. I wonder if we're gonna have to fight Johanna after this. We can do this. I don't know I keep saying Johanna, it's Johanna. Much thanks. I'm obliged. I owe you. With blade in hand. Stroll, I sap your defenses. You first. Huh. Now accept your fate. The Hulkenberg's being stared at. Oh shit, that was my turn. Okay. I shall vanquish evil. You know, just go after the main body. Okay, eyes are out. Still hitting us. Okay, everyone's defense is back With to normal. I crush you. In the I call upon royal power within. Let's buff again. Oh, power of kings. I'll pass High's Maze turn. Not out of heal, yet. and I'll have Hulkenberg buff too. Thank you. My thanks. Come. Oh, he just dies. Okay. I guess I shouldn't have expected those things to stay gone forever. But at least it buys us a little time. It buys us a turn when it does that. Oh, 
Okay, eyes are back. No holding back. My son must wait. I use what I must. Magra gather. Okay, that that at least heals a decent amount. I'll target the eyes. Because I do a lot of damage. Same with Hulkenberg, too. If I can at least get one of the eyes down. Okay, this doesn't do too much if we guard. So we'll do that. Let's see how this plays out. A defensive start. I can take it. Nice crit. Some darker arts. Apologies. Would you finish it? We can do this. Medi. Quite a boon. I'm obliged. Helpful as ever. Observe for all that we strive for. All right. Oh, another crit. Hulkenberg, I love you. Both her and Stroll did great this turn. Alright, then I'm gonna cyclo the main body. Okay, nothing. Hulkenberg, you just heal yourself this turn. Swordmaster! I'll cut you down! I die hard! Face me! Good hits, good hits. I show no mercy. Commendable Barry. Okay, one more turn, we're done. Oh, my darling. Mama's oh, no. here. Mama will always be here for you. Here. Take all the magic I have. Oh, no. She healed the demon baby? Please. Can we do something about her? You know, I, I thought this fight was a little too straightforward. No, of course she heals it back to ten. Well, at least it's only back to half health. So we don't have to fight too much. Swordmaster. That's like she brought the eyes back, though. I can slash. Let us clean up this. Die! Shame ailments don't work on the bosses. We're not out of this yet. Much thanks. Thank you. My thanks. Okay, that's fine. That's basically a free turn for us then. No, not really a free turn, but you know. I stand ready. Freezing. the play I shall vanquish evil <laughs> nice crit nice one, Stroll. face me Rancor. let's go wind is that come I crush you they yet cling to it almost takes out the eye okay that's not great that's not great either. He's gonna have trouble aiming. This calls for one of these. My friends. Okay, let's take out that eye. With healing power. Quite a boon. Trust me. Helpful as ever. Hulkenberg goes for Skullcracker. Nice, a crit. And Slicer. Tougher than I thought. Okay, 
Okay, that's not too bad. Uh, let's see. Let's use the spirit deal. I'll use this. Thanks. Thank you. My thanks. I will find magic seeker. Scour. Attack this turn. Still up. Just get a nice chunk of damage off on it. Nice crit, Hulkenberg. Alright, and then I think I finish it with Cycle Up. Nice! Alright, die, you foul creature. Hey, this will be a perfect head for the competition. Oh, we mastered a... Uh, Fighter. Not bad at all. I admit, it's it. Huh? I have never. Ah, I didn't know I had it in me. Slash dodge. Health font. Max HP by twenty. Not long ago, I, too, had a child. But I couldn't protect him. It was in a nearby village. Some paripus started a riot, and my son was caught in the middle of it. They beat him until he was barely recognizable. Even bloodied and battered, he clung to life. But his body was broken. He couldn't move, and not a single person came to his aid. He was a Yujif, and to them, that's all he was. But he was a helpless child, left to die in a pool of his own blood. By the time I finally got to him, it had been hours. It was too late. I had no idea. I couldn't abide it. Reality was too painful, and I ran until I was spending my nights and days in the sandworms pit. Better to live in solitude than in the embers of hell. That was the real reason I lived in that den of beasts. I thought death would be a mercy. Oh, is my... And then, these meddlers came along. They dragged me under the night sky I'd not seen in many seasons. And beneath those stars, it finally came to me. This is not the life my son would have wanted for me. That thought changed my whole perspective. His memory deserves love, not pain. Look with your eyes and your heart. You can ignore it no longer. You loved your child, not this creature. And the child you loved is gone. If I could have sacrificed my life instead. I swear I would have done it. I loved my son with all of my heart. I know. Nobody could ever deny you that. And now, the nightmare is over. What do we do? Do we present this creature as evidence? I don't know. Our testimony is likely not enough to prove this monster was behind the disappearances, and it would be easily denounced as a publicity stunt. True. 
Do you recall the promise I made when first we met? I pledged my political support if you were able to solve this matter. I fear that after all this, it is a boon I can no longer provide. But if you need a head to present to the judges, perhaps it could be my own. I don't know what you mean. Please take me to the exhibition of the brave. I will confess the truth before the masses. Surely the evidence will be undeniable when heard from my lips. Hmm. Yet as a holy woman, it would be bold faced to ignominy to Sanctifex Forden. You risk dire consequences, possibly even without trial. I have but one request. Before I depart, I would ensure all my duties are passed to my successor. I know I ask much of you. But would Barden and I be permitted to join you in Oceana later on? I will atone for my sins. For my son's sake, I must. What should we do? There's no guarantee she won't take this opportunity to escape. Hmm. But I see her point. The people here have suffered enough unrest. If she is to leave them, she must ensure they still have guidance. Else they'll fall to chaos and panic. You are our captain. The decision is ultimately yours. Let's trust her. I'm choosing to trust Joanna. The rumors painted Heisme as a criminal, but I chose to believe in him. I want to extend Joanna the same grace. Right. A country where no one's future is written in stone. If that's our goal, then this is a chance we have to take. You're too nice for your own good. But you might have a point about not forcing her. Our treatment of her might reflect on her confession, too. Don't want anyone saying we coerced it out of her. Then to settle. Oh, thank you for your kindness. A thousand times. Thank you. Oh, how curious. It's as if a... The fog has finally lifted from me. I've heard the news about Lady Joanna. Oh, pardon. I will assume the duty of her escort to the exhibition, and I will ensure the warrant on Heisme is taken down. Rest assured, your bounty will be paid in full. After all, I asked that you find the true culprit, and so you did. Ha-ha! <laughs> I say, we could upgrade the gauntlet runner with some extra spondulix, eh? <laughs> Can you, like, not for one second, Nerus? I have a request. Could you donate a portion of the money to the bereaved families? I know it is not my place, but something must be done for them. Their pain must be unbearable. Not just some of it. It's all rightfully theirs. Well said. You hear no objections from me. All we really needed was a head for the exhibition. My word. You're all indeed true knights. I'll personally make sure the citizens all hear of your bravery and spirit. Just as long as you keep this out of the public ear until the exhibition, right? We can't have our opponents finding out and trying anything underhanded. You have my solemn word. I'm glad I entrusted this to you. All right. Donated the bounty to the victim's families. All right. Heisme, it was thanks to you that we found the truth. We'd not have revealed the culprit or the secret of the castle on our own. I agree. If Barden thinks we're true knights all, that goes double for you. If you've nowhere else to go from here, perhaps you might join us. And further lend us your strength. Hmm. You're in this race to become king, are you? Not exactly. Look, you think it'd be all right to tell Heisme the truth? Yeah, he's one of us at this point. We've come this far together. It's fine by me. Yes, I have no objections either. 
We told Heisme everything, from the prince's survival to our plot for Luis's favor. So his royal highness lives. I see now why you all fought so desperately. Would you lend us your strength? <laughs> you already know my answer. My life may not weigh much, but I gladly pledge it to your noble cause. Hey, glad to have you on board, man. If I'm to choose a lord out of loyalty instead of dependence, then there's absolutely no shame in that. Not a lord. A friend. Hear, hear. Wow, we soared in popularity. 981 now? We were at 4,000 before. After solving the case, I've gained support from the people of Martira. I'm one step closer to Luis in executing our plan to save the prince. Damn, we're on the top 1,000. I wish I could have done more to help in Martira. I was so ready to prove myself, too. Hmm? Huh? Galica seems to be doubting herself. She wanted to play a more active role, but I suppose things didn't go according to plan. But maybe I found something better. A goal worth chasing. So I'm gonna focus on that from now on. I can sense Galica's newfound motivation and faith in me. The mystical fairy, Galica. Keeper and heritor of the mage's virtues. Through thy shared bond, a new heroic embodiment slumbering within thee has come to blossom. Okay, so get the upgrade from the mage. Bear this new power. Foster this connection. And by their strength, fulfill thy destiny. It's you and me. Okay. Wizard. Our destinies are intertwined. Enemy analysis and squad battle is now more detailed. Ooh, okay. Let's see what wizard gives us. Okay. Now all we have to do is head to Brylehaven and wait for Joanna to arrive. Ah, about that. Dash it inconvenient, but there's apparently been a landslide on the valley road. Utterly impossible. So we'll have to uh wait wait a couple days. I'm guessing it's gonna take about eleven ten, eleven days. The old road crews should have the mess cleared by the competition, so until then, your time is yours to waste. Time marches on, and the age of the new king draws nearer. Man. The deadline is... It, it'll be a few days till the road to Brylehaven is restored. Why don't we make ourselves useful and see if anybody needs our help until then? Excellent suggestion. The city's residents still face manifold problems. If we were to lend a hand, then we stand to gain by improving our own reputations as well. True. We could also supplement our funds by taking on sim a simple bounty or two. Perhaps we should see what's available. Well then, let's make most of the time available to us. It's up to you what we do next. It's up to you what we do next, Heldrick. Okay. All right. So I think I'm going to end things off here, actually. So in the next one, I think we're going to complete this quest that we got from uh, uh, Cuculus. So we'll go to the graveyard, and then we'll uh, probably unlock a bond with him. So. Oh, wait, who's this? Barden? That's interesting. Oh, we can rank up with Stroll and Hulkenberg as well. Oh, yeah, and of course, Maria. Yeah, I'll figure out what we do in the next time. 
But yeah, we're, we're probably just going to do the quest first and then uh, everything else. Alright, so I'll see you all then. Bye!